Good, Good morning, morning Ospreys! Miss Month! And Mr. Sink, here with your last news of 2020 for Wednesday, December 23rd. Mr. Sink, I am so proud of our Ospreys. You're not going to believe the list of winners we have of the classes who use the mystery reader clues to guess who our two mystery readers were for this week. Are you ready? Right? You have like Here a Oh man. I feel That's a little bit like Santa Claus. I was gonna say that looks like Santa's so list. You better check it twice. Yep. So here we go. Some of our winners were Mrs. Gavea's class, Mrs. Russomano's class, Mrs. Cuscinello's class, Miss Simmons class, whew, Mrs. Taylor's class. I could be here all day, Mr. Sink. It was absolutely amazing how many Ospreys knew who our mystery readers were. Now, are you ready to find out who they were? I think I am. Are you? Mm-hmm. Our mystery readers were Mrs. Eastburn and Mr. Spink. Ah, I was one of your mystery readers, along with my sister. I hope you enjoyed Auntie Claus, the second in the series. We shared last year the first one of the series. So if you want to check it out, check out the YouTube channel of the school district. I mean, George A. Mitchell School. And check out those videos as well. I'm so happy to be joining the Mystery Reader Club because I heard it's expanding soon. Oh, yes. This just in straight from the North Pole. We are going to have one more Mystery Reader for the 2020 school year. And I want to give you one clue first okay it is not the grinch oh thank good it's not the grinch because you yeah. know he doesn't have that spirit that the ospreys yeah. do mm -hmm. he came to our school which was so cool but he took a picture in front of the mystery reader wall of fame and i was like oh mr grinchy silly so you don't get a spot on our mystery reader wall yeah. grinch not just yet there grinch so here we go are you ready for this week's Mystery reader clues. I am, I am. Here is one clue of their picture with their dog also wearing a Disney shirt. So perhaps that's an additional bonus clue. But their clues are <clears throat> they are new to the George Mitchell School as well as teaching kindergarten. Oh. They have one son. Oh. And a daughter on the way. A baby on the way? Oh, my darling, there's a baby on the way. I'm so excited. Our Mitchell School family can get bigger and bigger. Awesome. Uh huh. So over our winter break, hmm, we're going to be finding out who that mystery reader is. So, boys and girls, if you think you know, have, tell your parents, tell your teachers, and have them email me. And we'll let you know if you get it right, okay? So exciting. I love mystery readers. It's so much fun. Speaking of fun, as I hear our principal, our beloved Mrs. Guinan, keeps creating sight word activities for us to enjoy and learn. They're I mean, so good. Yeah, there's so many activities. activities. It's great. I mean, we, but everyone should just, like, practice over winter break, too. Imagine how smart we'd be when we came back by having mm -hmm. a little fun, playing some games, and learning along the way. Oh, my garland. So much fun. Having fun. I got one last joke for you for two hours. <sighs> I waited all year for this, Mr. Sink. All right. Are you ready? It's a good one. Here we go. So, what is an elf's favorite music? An elf's favorite music. Well, I don't know. Rap. Oh, that's a good one, Mr. Sink. I get it. Rap while they're rapping. <laughs> rapping presents, rap music. Oh, man. Oh, darling, you got me. Oh, well, I think we should turn it over to ourselves from our previously recorded Pledge of Allegiance. Will everyone please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. Attention, salute. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, 
one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have all right, Mitchell School. We are just so happy to have gotten to come to you one last time from our homes for our last newscast. We want to wish you and your families a very happy holiday and a safe and happy new year. We'll see you again next year. Bye. Bye, Ospreys. Adios. Bye.